It's official. These two can finally get married. The Thai king signed same-sex marriage into law on Tuesday, making Thailand the first country in Southeast Asia to recognise marriage equality. Queer couples will have to wait 120 days for the law to come into effect, but from January they will be able to walk down the aisle. And judging by this rainbow display from this year's Pride March, they are sure to be colourful events. The law also replaces terms such as men, women, husbands and wives with gender-neutral language and gives same-sex couples the same rights to adoption and inheritance as heterosexual ones. The country's former Prime Minister Svetsa Tavisson, who was instrumental in the legislation, took to social media to celebrate the moment. Another important step for Thai society, the marriage equality law has been passed. Equality is tangible in Thai society. Gender diversity will finally be fully accepted. Congratulations. But the victory did not come easily. For decades, LGBTQI activists have campaigned for equal rights in the Buddhist kingdom, where many still hold conservative values. Then earlier this year, love won out when the Senate voted through the legislation 130 votes to four. Thailand now joins the growing list of more than 30 countries who have opted for the more inclusive form of marriage and is the third in Asia after Taiwan and Nepal. It is also widely recognised as one of Asia's most queer-friendly nations.